Okay, we're going to be using the Street Atlas USA 2011 Plus. Uh, we're going to be using it to compile our um, telephone numbers for our call list. As I mentioned in an earlier video, uh, the, when you voice broadcast, there's basically two stages. The first stage is you compile your call list, and that's a list of your phone numbers. The second stage is plugging those phone numbers into iBus Pro and have iBus Pro call them. Now, this is the first stage. We're going to put together a call list. I think the best way to arrange a call list is by zip code. Um, so I've got us at a uh, site here, zipcodes.com. It has all the zip codes there in the United States. Let's scroll down and I'll click on Tennessee. That's where I live. Okay, these are all the towns and cities in Tennessee. Uh, let's scroll down to Mount Juliet, which is where I live, and click on Mount Juliet. Okay, as you can see, there are two zip codes in Mount Juliet. We're kind of a small town. There's zip code 37121 and zip code 37122. What you could do is compile two separate call lists, one for one zip code and another for the other zip code, and voice broadcast. One week you voice broadcast to one zip code, and the next week voice broadcast to the other zip code. Or you could voice broadcast to both of them at the same time, however you want to do that. That's up to you. Now let's go back, and let's go to Nashville, Tennessee which is, a, of course, a fairly large city, and I live just outside of Nashville. We'll click on Nashville, and let's see, scroll down. As you can see, there are several zip codes in Nashville. Uh, now, let's choose 37215. Let's say that our church is in zip code 37215, and we, want, we know that we want to avoid broadcast to everyone in that zip code. Let's compile a call list of 37215. So let's get out of this. Now here's our icon for our Street Atlas. The Street Atlas comes in the mail, and of course you, you download it into your computer. There's the icon, let's click on it, and we'll pull up our Street Atlas. Uh, this is an amazing piece of software, what you can do as far as the maps and the, uh, the zip codes and the phone numbers. It enables you to really take a strategic approach to your voice broadcast. Okay, it gives us a box that we don't need. All right, on the left side over here, you can see we've selected phone, on the right side, we already have 37215 in there, but just I'll just put that back in there again. All right, 37215 is the zip we're going to search. On the left side over here, it says residential and business. We don't need business listings, so let's get out of that. Here's the search uh, tab button. Let's push on search there. This is our first 1,000 listings. The way the Street Atlas works is it allows you to create files of up to 1,000 listings. You, you can't go above 1,000. Okay, here's the first 1,000, and I think there are about 7,000 to 8,000 listings in 37215. Here's the first 1,000. There's a button down here called Add. We click on Add. Brings all these listings over to the right-hand side. Now, there's a button that says To File. We're going to click on it, and this is where we create our file and name. I'm going to put it in my documents, and since it's 37215, we're going to name it 37215. File one. Save that. All right. Now it says remove down here. Let's remove that thousand and click on more. It's going to give us our second thousand. Click on add. Brings it over to the right side. Click on to file and we're going to name this file three seven two one five file two. Save that. All right. Let's remove those. Click on more. We're going to do four of these. Let's do four files. There's the, th uh, the next thousand. I'm going to click on add. Brings it over to the right hand side. Click on to file. Name it 37215 file 3. Save that. Remove those. And let's do the next. Click on more. There's our next 1000. We're going to click on add. To file. And let's name it 37215 file 4. Okay, let's save that. Alright, now we have four files. Each has 1,000 listings in it, and that's in 37215. Uh, now let me show you something that's really neat. Let's go over to the Find button. Click on Find. It says Type of Place Name or Address. Let's go to 37215. Search. And it's going to give us a map. And the map is of the 37215 zip code area. 
and as you can see it's in the southeastern part of Nashville and Davidson County let's uh, scroll up a little bit there's downtown Nashville as you can see southwest of downtown Nashville there is 37215 zip code now let's uh, scroll down a little bit further here and, and get get into that okay I've, I've clicking here I'm looking at the uh, 37215 let's zoom in up here on the right you can zoom zooming further this is going to be in the very north end of it as you can see we've got names in uh, names of streets coming up let's zip in, uh, zoom in just a little bit further still in that 37215 in fact let's scroll down a little bit more give us a little bit more room in there okay let's zoom in a little further and let's uh, see if we can bring it up a little bit gives us a little bit more room let's zoom in a little further okay, it's going to start naming these streets these smaller streets there's Woodmont, Woodlawn, Kenner Avenue but uh, what you can do is you can actually click on an individual street and it will give you the names and phone numbers of everyone that's in that, uh, that zip code. Let's see if I can get in a little bit closer where we can get into some streets. Okay, let's just a minute. A little bit more room. Ah, much better. Okay, let's zoom in a little bit further. And there's a faster way to do this, I'm sure. I'm just doing it slowly. There we go. This was kind of slow, but uh, when did you see the process? Okay, we're in. Th this is the green outline of 37215. These are the individual streets. Let's say our church is located on uh, Knollwood Road over here. Click right click on that. Gives you thing for uh, you can click on phone listings for the block or the whole street. Let's click on the whole street. It's going through the listings. Now here on the left side, these are the listings. It's going through a few more. The, the on the left side over here is everyone that lives on Nowood Nowood Road, Nashville, Tennessee. Names, uh, addresses, and phone numbers. So you can fine tune your search to uh, not only zip codes but individual streets and neighborhoods and. Just uh, you can fine tune this zero in wherever you want to go. But like I said, I think the best way to go is in zip codes, and we've already started with the uh, 37215. Now let's uh, get out of our street atlas. I'm going to go to my documents. Okay, this shows the document, the files that we created for 37215. That's file one, file two, file three, and file four. Uh, now in the next video, I'm going to show you how to take these files and put them into plug them into iBuzz Pro and iBuzz Pro will call everyone in the files. And we'll get to that next video now.